Hey everyone, welcome to Crossway Kids Online today. What have you been up to lately? Have you been to the beach? Or been on a walk, playing sport? I don't know. You know what I've been doing? I've been fishing. It's been so much fun. But anyway, enough about that. Why don't you come with me and let's find out what we're doing today. Hey, fellas. Alan, my friend. What's up, friend? I totally value your friendship. Wow, thank you so much. Right back at you. You got a story for us? Oh, you know I do. Today's story is about the importance of, well, friendship. These verses come from the book of Ecclesiastes, which was written by a very wise teacher named... Horvath. That's my basis. Well, speaking of friends, this is my friend Horvath. That's right! I am Horvath. I am an expert in combining the mental trainings of learning the Bible with the physical trainings of making your muscles bigger. Ah. Yep. Plus, good friends help each other out. So I'm so glad you're here to help me out. Well, let's do this! Ah. So, like I was saying, these verses are from the book of Ecclesiastes. Huh? Uh, Ecclesiastes. Huh? Ecle huh? It's a book in the Bible. It's a word that means teacher. Oh, Ecclesiastes. Yeah, right. Um, well, here's what the teacher wrote about friendship. Two people are better than one. They can help each other in everything they do. All right, first exercise. Oh, OK. OK, I call this the two-person invisible chairs. You stand back to back with your best friend oh. like this. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And then you sit down together in your invisible chair using your friend for support like this. Oh, okay. And we do this 109 times. Well, that seems Go. Like, oh, okay. One. One. 27. 27. <laughs> Angel food cakes. Mm, I like that. Lawn green. <laughs> Who is that? 109. Yeah, that was great. Woo. You make me laugh. Well, <laughs> thank you. That helped prove the teacher's point, Horvath. Yeah, I did. Two people are better than one. You could not do that exercise by yourself. No! no. One! Oh. oh, oh, no, no, here, here, here. Ah! 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 Oh. You, you okay? Yeah, let's do this! <laughs> ah! Right. Oh, okay. oh, right. <laughs> the verse continues. Suppose either of them falls down, then one can help the other one up. But suppose a person falls down and doesn't have anyone to help them up then feel sorry for that person. Yeah. It's good to have a friend around, and not when you just physically fall down. Uh. You can help others when you're struggling with schoolwork. They can listen when you've got problems you need to talk about. Uh -huh. Friends can help carry each other through tough times. Oh, all right, next exercise. I call it the friend carry. So you grab your friend by the waist, and lift them like this. Face that way. Oh, okay. Okay, I grab your waist. Ready? Oh. One, two, three. Boom! Oh. Okay, we do this 499 times. Oh, wait, are you gonna... Okay, here we go. Ready? One. Oh, nine. nine. Small business loan. cha 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 Lay the hosen. 499. Okay, your turn. Oh, okay. Your turn, your turn, your turn. Let okay, me, okay. let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me. I am so sorry, Horvath. You are too heavy for me. I'm not heavy. I'm your brother. You're my... Let's do this! Oh, okay, okay. Uh, the next part of the verse. One person could be overpowered, but two people can stand up for themselves. A rope made out of three cords isn't easily broken. No! Well, that's another way friends can be there for one another. If you're being picked on or talked about behind your back, a friend can stand up for you. Some people think three chords in the verse represents you, uh, your friend, huh? and God. Oh. So when you have friends who trust God and follow Jesus, it can help you stand stronger. I love it! Oh! <laughs> Next exercise! Okay, it takes two to stand. Stand on one foot, then choose a friend to stand on one foot. You! Oh, okay. Then put your arm around your friend. And hop in a circle together like this. Here we go. Oh, yeah. yeah, very good. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Hey. We do this 40 million times. Wait, that's not possible. Go! Oh, okay. One. 
three. Three. <laughs> Max Headroom. I remember that guy. <laughs> She's Danish. We have to be close. 40 million. Here we go. Ah. 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 Oh, dizzy. We did it. And I could not have done it without you, my friend. I'm dizzy. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. There we go. So friends are important. Uh -huh. That's why you should choose your friends carefully. Choose a friend that will be there for you, who will carry you through the tough times and who will stand up for you. You can ask God to help you find a friend like that. Uh -huh. And here's another tip. Uh -huh. If you wanna have a good friend, uh -huh. it's a good idea to be a good friend. Uh -huh. Feeling better, Horvath? Yes, thank you, Kellens. No problem, I'll see you next time. Okay, bye. Let me just grab my invisible chairs. Invisible chair! I, I don't think... Invisible, oh, there it is! Oh. Oh, oh he's lived on their knees. Oh, that's a heavy invisible chair. <laughs>